yeah. I'm excited today, guys. Welcome to the day. Welcome to day 15, I should say, of the summer of 619. I'm fucking excited right now because we're gonna play Dragon's Lair for the NES. Now, let me tell you something. This game fucking blows. This game is absolutely horrendous. It's probably one of the worst games I've ever played in my life. And um, we're gonna play it today. But I'm excited because I've been fucking practicing. And you'll understand what I mean by I say I've been practicing to, to beat this sh to Fuck, man. I'm, th th my words. My words aren't even coming out of my mouth right because this game is so terrible. Let's start this shit. This game is so terrible. This, this fucking game. Okay, let's save state because there's no way I'm going to make this out without save saving. Save stating, I should say. Alright, jump. Oh, I paused the game. Jump, Dirk. You fucking moron. Fuck you, Dirk. Okay, there we go. Okay, so this game is a port of an arcade game that's basically an interactive DVD. Oh, shit. It's basically like an interactive movie. And some idiot had the... Uh, no, 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 no. Some genius had the great idea of porting it to the NES. And we got this. This incredible game. Oh, Jesus, man. This fucking game. Okay, finally. I beat that cocksucking snake penis thing ocean dick okay there we go now let's see if i can get this up here no i fucking can't fuck you dirk by the way dirk is the protagonist i'm playing as uh in the original dragon's lair game for the arcade dirk the protagonist you see here was attempting to save princess daphne who i'll flash a picture of on the screen right now and i really hope princess daphne is worth all this because this game this, the stuff you have to go through in this game, shit, I just got killed by a snake dick that's coming out of the wall. Die, die, die. Okay, now, it may look like I'm playing this and the game is working correctly, but what the shit? Okay, okay, just, just, just okay, yeah, just don't even, what the hell? Is just, this entire game is so fucking weird. I mean, it's a terrible port. This is one of the worst port. Fuck. There's... Okay, here's the thing about this game. You people have heard me talking about how I hate games with one-hit kills, like... Uh, the first Bubsy game, Dark Castle, and all that. Well, this takes that to another extreme, because if you notice in the right-hand side of the screen, there is an energy bar, but there... Most of the thing, like... God, man, most of the things in this game, they kill you with one hit anyways. So it doesn't fucking matter if you have a life bar. Okay, I can fucking do this. I just I just did this like half an hour ago. I can do this. Yeah, don't get rammed by the gigantic wooden cock, Dirk. Oh, God, the snake's coming out of the walls. Now I'm gonna get... Oh, shit. There we go. Like, I'm gonna die intentionally a couple times just to show you guys what the fuck is going on in this game. And I'm lagging a little right now. And there's, uh, there's bats coming out of a, a vagina in the wall. Uh, yeah, I mean, just everything hurts you in this game. Like, the, the, the bats don't kill you. The bats don't kill you, but there are cotton balls that come out of doors that do. Like, right here. Like, watch this. He's just gonna kill me. Yep, I'm gonna turn into a big old sack of bones because this guy threw a cotton ball at me. And I can't defend myself against this guy. I've tried. But he just, he hits you every time and you gotta run like a fucking pussy. You gotta run like a pussy every time he comes and hits you with the cotton ball. Oh, shit. This is ridiculous. I hate this game. I just... Why do I play these games? I don't even understand sometimes. I don't know why I play these games sometimes. Maybe I'm a masochist. I know I'm a masochist. I mean, just some of the things I watch. There's no reason for me to be watching them. Like, like Sword Art Online. There's no reason for me to be watching that garbage. But I do anyways. Okay, he got the D. Oh, shit. He got the D and then was uh, killed by the other D. Okay, yeah. Fuck you. And there's nothing you can... Oh, the, the, oh, the bat went straight up in his ass. I don't think Princess Daphne's gonna like that, uh, Dirk. She's, she may ask some questions why you have a bat in your ass when you save her. This is ridiculous. This is absolutely horrendous. And I, I know I throw words around like terrible and fucking awful, but this really, really is. Okay, let's see how I can... Yeah, there we go. That's beautiful. Okay. Now, here's a very dumb segment where there's a gap in the ground if you can see it. Now, you have to stop from getting impaled with the wooden dicks. 
and there's bats right there and if you continue further here you fall and die and if you jump up you no what well, no dirt dirt don't get an attitude with fucking me you gotta jump up son okay there we go oh no oh i got killed by the fucking wooden penis just coming out of the fucking god man this game okay so if you jump to this side no you can't even jump to this side this game is incompetent enough to jump to the right okay so if you jump to this side you almost get killed by the wooden thing but if you yeah i just got killed by the snowball can you look at all this shit on the screen right now what did, what did i even get killed by there was it the wooden stake was it the cotton ball was it the the bat i don't know this game doesn't know either now let's let's actually take the time and i fucking die god damn it okay okay dirk you you're almost there you're almost there i actually did that relatively quickly Okay, now there's another asshole. You can't even jump to the side in this game. It's just that's just too complicated. Jumping to the side? What does that mean, jumping to the side? You can't jump to the side. You gotta jump up or down. That's just too complicated for this game to understand. There's all these fucking bats, man. I'm about to die. There's like Here's the thing. Oh and god damn. Oh shit. Okay. So I'm gonna do this. This is like a little uh, god, man. This, um, my god. No, I can't even throw the daggers quickly enough to kill the snake. That's just too fucking hard. Okay. Nope, it's it's too hard, Dirk. You can't even. Oh man, what the fuck is killing me? What did it? What killed me? What the hell is? What like legitimately? I don't understand what's killing me. What the fuck is? Okay, I guess this is a good position to be in, maybe? What the fuck kills me? Is it because he puts his fucking foot forward? Fuck! This game is terrible! What's killing me? Okay, player one start, nah, player one game over. This game can go fuck itself. I'm like, I played this game for about uh, 20 minutes-ish. I got to like the third stage and then I almost vomited all over my keyboard and uh, simultaneously diarrhea started coming out of my ass, but you guys don't want to hear about that. Um, this game is terrible. If you ever get the chance to play this game, don't. Do anything but play Dragon's Lair on the NES. And uh, whoever made this game can go fuck themselves. Whoever decided that this would be a good idea to make an interactive, like an interactive video game that's arcade based into an NES game just like they did with Athena but Athena wasn't like uh, like this uh, whoever thought that was a good idea should also fuck off I hope they got blackballed from the video game industry after doing this shit uh, I mean if that ran it is it enough to, to make you stay away from this game you're probably crazier than I am so thank you for supporting these videos um, Tomorrow is going to be a special day, because if you thought today was bad, I'm playing a game tomorrow on this same console. I'm starting to play a game tomorrow, I should say, that's uh, even worse than this. So, stay tuned for that. Thank you guys for supporting all these videos. Um, leave a comment in the comment section if you guys want. Uh, thank you, peace out, goodbye, and fuck Dragon's Lair for the NES.